Okay, this one, uh, this one is made in a way that a young man can carry them. They can just sling them at the side of them uh -huh. and put their pen or their notebook or everything yeah. to school. So yeah. here, my young man, young boy, okay. you can take it and there you are. And it's even green and gold. Yes. Like yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. cool. There we go. All right, look up here. Yeah. You're most welcome. <laughs> Okay, okay, this I video, need... I will make a short story, a short story from the Highlands. Okay. Like when, Turn our, a sideways when in, in our, our traditional times, when a father is going away for a hunt or for a business trip, any business yeah. at all, yeah. mm -hmm. he's going away. And when he's for some three weeks or two weeks or so, and when he's on the way, he, he already knew, have in mind that there's someone in the house already. Mm -hmm. warming up the house. Mm -hmm. So when he comes close and he will see the chimney coming, the smoke's coming out from the chimney. Mm -hmm. And then he will feel that, mm -hmm. he, he will be very happy that yeah. someone is in the house, warming up the house, making the place uh, mm -hmm. good, inviting for him to arrive. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So Understand. that someone uh -huh. is the wife. Uh -huh. That's why I would like to present these balloons for your wives. Oh, okay. Because they, those are the ones where warming up the house, uh -huh. uh, getting you prepared to come here and waiting for you to come and making the house, uh, letting not the cobwebs coming into and make lots mm -hmm. of what dead or something like that. Understand. But there's someone in the house, warming up the house, making the place look attractive for uh, yeah. and inviting mm -hmm. for visitors and for you especially. Mm -hmm. oh, so that's why I would like to present this balloon to to you oh, for your okay, wife. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. She love that. Thanks, yeah, the thank flower. Thank you very much. Yeah. For this one to Daniel for your wife. Okay. Alex, hold it. Hmm? Thanks for your wife. Thank you. All the presents you have Eric. is for you. Yeah. But mine especially for your wives. And this. Mm -hmm. It's not for your wife. It's for your daughter. Oh. So, like, uh, your yeah. daughter, your daughter gave a present, a gift to Carissa last year. That's my oh, that's I why. see. That, I see. So, yeah. that's the little bill of okay, So yeah. we call this bill a big short bill. Mm -hmm. Like it's the latest bill that young girls or ladies uh -huh. usually put this. Just like the. Okay. Yeah. 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 So yeah. it's for, it's meant for the young it girls uh -huh. and young. Okay, so I don't know if you can see that sunrise behind me or not. It looks kind of white in the screen. Unfortunately, it's really quite beautiful. Uh, today's our last day in Hellsbach. Uh, we're fixing to go down to the boat. And uh, we're going to go over to the Tommy Islands and look at some carving. And then head on over into Ley. I am very hopeful that this trip will be nothing at all. Even remotely like the trip.
Okay, so I've been a really bad vlogger. I haven't really done anything lately. Um, the trip by boat from uh, Hellsbach back to Ley was pretty much uneventful. It was sunny, but there were enough clouds to keep things cool, and the water was like glass. So unlike the earlier trip out, it was relatively calm and peaceful. Um, the following day, we well, we stayed overnight at the guest house in Ampo, and I didn't bother to vlog that again because it's in the earlier vlog, pretty much everything that could be done about it. And then we flew from Ley to Port Moresby on yesterday. Um, wasn't really much to see in Port Moresby, at least not, but was around us. So we flew out of there, we left the hotel uh, about six in the morning flew back to Cairns, went through Australian Customs and all the stuff we had from Papua New Guinea cleared except for the uh, lizard skin top to uh, Gary's drum which they took off. They gave him the base of the drum but not the, the top so he can't really drum on it. Um, when we had a late, later flight than anticipated down to Sydney um, from we had a rainstorm right as the plane landed and uh, couldn't pull to the gate because the uh, uh, workers weren't out there. But we got in, uh, we took the train into the town. We've got a four day pass, so we're good to ride the trains pretty much wherever we want and the ferries. And we got to the Sydney Harbor Youth Hostel, we're checked in, and we came up to the roof. Um, this is the view behind me. Do you see that? Do you see that? The Sydney. Opera House. I'm going to flip this around now so you can uh, see it better. Okay, so there's the famous Opera House. And as I pan this way, you can see the famous Harbor Bridge. Uh, this is all from the uh, top deck of the hostel where we're staying. So it's a great location. Um, don't know what all we're going to do while we're here, but we're here.